Welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door, and uh, let's get the star piece I missed last time. There it is! But uh, there's one more thing we can get while we're here. Is it a secret? Kinda. It's a, a little bit of a secret, a little bit of a, you know, crucial thing, but uh, just to make our way over here, and... Is it a... Oh. It's Wacka! We'll whack him! Okay! It's a whack a bump! 25 HP, 25 flower points healed. That's gonna come in handy. That's disgusting. You just, like, hammered off his scab or something and I'm gonna use it as a healing item. It tastes good. It helps. Well, okay. It looks like you just... Oh, you you took something very important from a Japanese mascot character from an arcade, so... His his lumps taste like nougat, and his scabs taste like cranberries. Oh, they're just dripping in caramel. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, 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 oh. Delicious. Uh, what a hit! Oh, we're so powerful, I love it. Alright, we're... I can tell Mario's awake for this episode. <laughs> Let's yes. go, let's kill things in one hit, yeah! Yeah, I'm, feel, I'm feeling good, I'm feeling feel really good about this. We got Bob Ray on our, on our team, he's, he's gonna kick a lot of ass. We got uh, Vivian on our side, we got Goombella on our side. All these strong, powerful peeps on our side, and Mario's be you know beefed up with them. So, what I'll do here, is I'm gonna go ahead and take out this guy to make sure he doesn't touch any of my flower points. Because I don't even really need him! God, that's even, power. Even Bobbery can take him out in one hit. You see, all you're doing is just give me more experience. <laughs> you know, it's actually been so long since I've seen one of those guys multiply. In, in like, recording time. I completely forgot they did that. And now they are done for. Not a problem. <laughs> Let's see that third third level up in a chapter, man. Let's see how long we can keep this uh, cocky arrogance up. <laughs> yeah, messed well, it up already. <laughs> Yow. I think I jumped first and then saw the plant second. It's too bad we can't find like an accessory that's called like Mario. Oh no! Sh Mario shit kickers puts on steel toed boots. Yeah. <sighs> oh, come on! Oh, you ki- oh. <laughs> That's what I get for believing in myself. The game destroys me for it. Never have confidence. This is what games have taught me. If you have confidence, everything is ruined. <laughs> it will take it away from you. Huh. And I I'm dizzy and poisoned. Can you imagine? You just- you just- you Stumbling around the room. Oh, where am I? Blah, you, you puke up blood and just toxic fumes. Oh, wow, so Mario's intoxicated. Great. <laughs> the perfect comparison. Ah! ah! Come on! <laughs> See? Nothing to it. Perfect. <laughs> Mario has a confidence microphone. It's listening to your every move. Just thinking, oh, hey, he's getting too good at this game. Let's knock him down a peg or two. Overleveled. No such thing. Yeah, sorry to jinx you when I said, you know what, you're actually getting quite powerful. We might actually uh -huh. be able to make it easy for- No. Never, never, never ever. Well, it's it's still no difficulty. I mean, we're, do we're doing pretty okay. We're, we're taking the normal amount of damage, but because our HP is so high, there's nothing to worry about. We leveled up twice, we got our flower points and our hit points up, so that's helping a lot, too. Uh, partners don't share the same HP, so if uh, Bobri gets too beat up, we can bring Vivian in or, some, or Goombella or somebody. So, you know, it's all about strategy. We, we got options. It's all good. You got the old bomb boy blowing up every chance he gets. Big bomb boy blowing up baddies. Beautiful. 
Do you think the amount of times a bob can explode, like, goes along with their age? Well, well I don't know. I mean, they obviously do just fine. I mean, he got... he's, he, he's an old bob -omb. You think, you know, a bob wouldn't live that long if, if they just, you know, died. Well, that's a good point. We got the old grizzled veteran on our side that can blow up at a moment's notice. Maybe that's like a certain species of Bob-omb. No, oh, maybe. Like a subset that doesn't actually explode like the pink bob -omb's. But like black bob -omb's, they're like... Orcs. <laughs> like, you know, the... The kind of orcs that you grow in mud. <laughs> Born from the goo of the earth. Rise, black bob -omb's. I'd be glad to know this is the last bit of backtracking we're gonna do for a long time. Oh wow! So if you think it's gonna be, you know, back, you know, back to here, back to the camp, back over there, back to the camp, no, it's this is it. Thought there'd be something in the trees. All right, here we are. This is the mysterious rocks that we'd seen earlier with Bobbery. Is it dead endness or dead endedness? Maybe if you just put it all together and make a sweet song out of it. Did yeah. end in this, did end in this. Well, uh we're gonna need Bobbery for this, certainly. Alright, Skull Captain casts his gaze, we're doing the best of a festival, and blah, 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 blah. Uh, the Stash Brothers best of friends, three times red stash lands on his head uh, on his end. Blue stash belly four times as wax, so let's hear those fireworks go boom. Okay. So explode on the red one three times, whack the hammer with the blue one four times? Well, thanks, Koss. So one, two, three, and then, uh, one, two, three, four. Nothing happened. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I see. There's a space in there, you know. Red, red jewel shines. Let's get. Oh, how, how can we? We got to put a red jewel in there first before we do the puzzle. And uh, Flavio seems to have a jewel that we're looking for. Come on, I just need to borrow your gem, just for a second. Actually, I want another cola. You want one of Flavio's Chocola Colas? It's gonna cost you extra. I wonder if I ask him for coins, he'll give them to me. All of a sudden, your pockets are filled with thousands upon thousands of coins. Oh! Well, I got the skull gem now, so what we do is we put the skull gem inside of the face. And now they're red. Ah, okay, yeah, let's count now. One, two, three, and then one, two, three, four. There we go! Beautiful. It's <laughs> a little anticlimactic. Can't jump up there. I see. But we can toss some Bobbery up there. There we go. Well, it was a small price to pay, all right? Oh, there it is. I'm never giving you one of my family's priceless heirlooms ever again, Mario. Yes, I'm very disappointed that he's leaving. No, wait, stop. No, come Please, back. Please, no. We need no. you. You're crucial to this mission. Flavio, how could you? How are you supposed to get an art community when you're just so standoffish like this? Scoffing at danger, my brave explorers enter the cave. Will they actually find the Pirate King's treasure? I tremble with anticipation. Hmm. 
Ooh. Taking Gumbella with us because I'm confident we're gonna get some new, uh... Some new enemies our way. Ooh. Ah, uh, boo. Ah, uh, boo, yarg. Oh, that looked like a way I could go. Oh, this one's red. That means he's hotter than the other fires. No, wait. That's backwards. Yeah, he's not that hot. Oh, that's right. These are called bubbles. I forgot those Mario okay. enemies. Yeah, a lava bu lava bubble. Like, bloop. There we go. We got a lava bubble. There we go. Explosions and ice attacks. Really? Hmm. The ice makes sense, but the explosions? Wouldn't that just make them, like, bigger? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. And you being paper, Mario, you are very susceptible to fire. Yes. Can't use Quake Hammer because they're technically not on the ground. There we go. So I guess Hammer's the only way to go. Take a bobbery for this one. Just to make sure I can do it all in one turn. Well, I can just do it with Power Smash, I guess. Yeah, nothing to it. Damn, seven. <laughs> I love how Bobbery looks confident after that fight, as if he did all the fighting. Jolly good show, yes! Good old boy! Aha! Oh, that was clever. I think we're gonna, like, power up two... Uh, two friends when we get back to town. Oh, damn. If we ever make it back home... We're Maybe Flurry... Flurry might actually get the upgrade she's been, uh, not been getting for, for weeks now. Hashtag think of Flurry. Please. Let Madame Flurry flourish. Flourish, yeah. Oh boy! <laughs> Hi, Big Bubble! Oh boy! Ha! Whoa! Six! Good lord! This, oh, this hurts. Alright, alright. Uh. Well, I'm gonna power smash this guy, get him out of the way quickly! Now, old boy. Now, oh, great. The fog. Uh. <laughs> and now they're taking out the audience! When hey! Will it, when will it end? Hey, good job! And then we brought it right back. All right, so that's that's good. That's good. I like where this is going. I don't Damn like where it. that's going. Oh, wait. oh no! Ah, that got rid Burned. of the fog. Well, that's cool. I don't know if it got rid of the fog or that was just the end of the fog. Oh shit! I picked the wrong thing. That's okay. I, Bobby, I mean, finish him off. Yeah, it still worked. Boom! Huh. Thank you, thank you. You're a wonderful audience. We're more than halfway there for uh, a level up, though, so that's good. Maybe we should start uh, spinning some of these star pieces. Oh. Oh. Uh, oh, shink. Yep, you're about to get got. Quick! Am I? Okay... Perfect timing! Wow, that is actually perfect timing. Man, I'm good! <laughs> hey, wait a minute, wait a minute. You know where confidence gets you, right? Don't do it! Ah! <laughs> Spoke too soon! See what, I, ah! see what I mean? Now you're getting got by bullet bills! Alright, alright. Let's get Gumbel out of here so she can at least tattle on him before he blows me the fuck up. <laughs> Gumbella, please, I've dealt with these guys since 86. I got it. Wait, I wasn't even alive then. I've been dealing with these guys since 91. There we go. Came out of the womb with a Nintendo controller in your hands. <laughs> and a Mario cap on my head. <laughs> oh, it's already gone. Well. Shush. Oh, he looks so sad. <laughs> they have little animations on their head. I love it. 
<laughs> so bullet, bullet bills, they, they do feel pain. Oh, man. Wow, and they're little wusses, too. Well, they're wusses if they don't attack me first. So they're good in guerrilla tactics. Yeah. At least until we get to these guys. Ah! Why? So fast. <sighs> now, I love how every enemy in the Mario universe has, like, a face and a consciousness. See, that's why we actually have to fight these bullets. Because they have eyes and a face. Later, we gotta fight every single bit of gunpowder. I was just thinking... <laughs> oh no, it's another 10 million molecules of dust! Let's fight it! Oh, and these are bill launchers, right? Yes. Bill blasters! Oh! So they just got higher defense. And what they like to do is they like to shoot out bullet bills, obviously, but then they become obstacles in your way. So you can't- I can't go hammer them. Oh. So you can only hammer the guy that's in front of you. So I have to jump on him. So I'll go with the spin jump. Well, yeah, I'll take out this guy first. Maybe I can knock him into them. And... Yeah, there we go, like that. Oh, that was cool. Then I can have Gumbella take out this guy. All or, right. so you or so you thought. Alright, okay, so... That was not my fault. Mm -hmm. Because she's jumping from a further place away, the timing is different. Oh. Yeah, ah, I see again. what you mean. Now. There we go. There. And this guy's gonna crash in my face. Ah, there we go. Wow. The game just mentioned that the crowd fell asleep during that fight. What are you going to do about that? Ah, they're awake now. Actually, I just got a comment, like, literally, like, an hour ago, telling me what happens when the audience falls asleep like that. And while I try and figure out what the hell I'm supposed to do here, I'm going to read it. Okay. Uh, oh, this is a huge comment. <laughs> oh, boy. Uh... I get less star points when the audience falls asleep. Oh, that's it? Apparently I don't use stylish moves, and I'm never gonna use stylish moves because I don't know how to do, how to do them. Maybe I'll, like, look one up. Yeah. Apparently appeals still work when they're asleep. And I get less star points as I get higher in level, and it's, 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 it's very helpful. Huh. So... Doesn't that mean we just have to use more of the the crystal star powers? Aren't those the stylish moves? No, nah, like... Okay, I, I guess stylish moves are like, you know, the advanced moves of Mario and Luigi. Like, if you if you press uh... B at a certain point instead of pressing A, then you can you know, you, you do more damage or something like that. Right, but right. I'm doing just fine you know, on my own. I don't need that, so... Oh, that's a big boy. That is a big boy. Oh, uh, speaking of comments, I actually uh, creeped on some of your uh, comment sections for this series, and uh, apparently we missed a boss fight. Yeah, we missed a lot. We've we've missed a partner. We've missed side quests. There's there's a whole lot to miss because what? the point the point is not to do everything because you can't. There's there's no way you can do absolutely fucking everything in an RPG, especially when you're, when you're in a comedic let's play like this. It would just kill the pacing. So uh -huh. I urge you all to go out and get it yourself. But we can't. Yes, you can. Just it's too it's fucking it. expensive. Do you need to buy the gold edition of the next Ubisoft pile of shit, or do you want to save up and get a good GameCube <laughs> game? Uh, speaking of which, it's time for my daily check. <laughs> how much is it going for now? Yeah, how much is it now? Uh, six days left, sixty-one dollars. Well, I'm not getting that one. Five days left. Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, I can buy it now for just the disc. Nah, hundred dollars, hundred. Good Lord! Right, it's just a hundred dollars. That instead of getting two PlayStation Four games, you get one GameCube game. That's really good, and apparently so deep that no Let's Play could convey all of it without Except it people being have, just a though. plain old walkthrough. People have though. 
Well, good for them. I'm not them. <laughs> All right, you got me. You got me. The point the way, of this uh, is also hear... to show you this game and how how different it is and all that shit. It is pretty good. And how great it is. And I'm gonna die soon. Stop dying. By the way, did you hear that um, uh, the Super Mario 3D All-Stars is basically big, giant emulators and people have found data for other games on their respective consoles on that uh, emulator? I just heard about it and... Uh, Oops. I really don't, really don't care about... Uh, 3D All Stars, to be honest. Like, I'm I'm more excited for 3D World. That's my jam right there. Oh yes, absolutely I think th my jam. Like, I think 3D World is my favorite Mario game. It's really good. Well, why don't we play it sometime, me bucko? Well, gotta wait till it comes out. <laughs> what am I gonna do? Play the Wii U version again? Hell no. Well, that's a good point. Cause then you'd have to dig out your Wii U and relive very painful memories. Yeah, like Star Fox Zero. Okay, that was my own damn fault. And you know, I even ponied up the extra effort to, you know, like, show it in the most positive light I could. Man, that didn't pan out. Oh, no, it didn't. It's like, hey, wouldn't it be really cool to test out the new Wii U capture card where I can capture the gamepad? Wouldn't that be a great idea to try Star Fox Zero? And then you find out that Star Fox Zero is a pile of garbage. <sighs> I should have played uh, Tokyo Mirage Sessions. Seriously, there's actually because, a use for the gamepad. Because that way only one of us will think it's a pile of garbage. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> you got me. <laughs> yeah, with this. Star Fox Zero, that was, uh, that was pretty mutual hatred we had there. I mean... So, I was like, we, this game sucks. You're like, oh my god, you're right, it sucks. And we both agreed. Well, it's just, why do they have to use gimmicks for literally everything? Like, the... The audio was only coming from the gamepad. Fucking ridiculous. Why wouldn't you have it on the main screen, too? God. So many bad decisions in Star Fox Zero. I'm glad it got the bad review scores. The thing you're bringing it to Switch, I'm thinking, will that change anything? I mean, it'll take out the secondary... Uh, yeah, the secondary screen they thought they had to use. I'm gonna use Art Attack to take these guys down. Yeah, time to wake up the audience, dude. Uh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. It's like Grunt's birthday party in Halo. <laughs> <laughs> Headshot, their head explodes into a bunch of confetti! Yay! And level up! Holy Hell god! Yeah. It did happen in this episode. I think we also ran a lot last chapter, so that's why we're leveling up so much. But I'll take it! It's up to BP, so we have leveled up all three things in one chapter. Dang. Let's spend them. My head rattle to the big attack. Damage proof on fire enemies? Uh, yes! Yes! Holy crap. Yes. And happy flower, why not? There we go! I feel like we've gained so much power from that. Oh, come on, Bobbery. <laughs> There's a key up there. There's, huh? Aha. Uh -huh. You know, I'm gonna make a little prediction here. I'm gonna grab my man Coops. Yep. Hold him there. Hold. Hold. And... Genius. Simply genius. How did you know? I just had a feeling. What if it's more than a feeling? I may more be dreaming. More than a feeling. <laughs> now we gotta make our way back. No, so, I you said no more backtracking. Yeah, I, was, yeah, I was about to say, but yeah, just damn just, it, just, just a little bit of backtracking. Yeah, just <sighs> just a tiny little bit. Uh, I, 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 I could have a montage of everything that happens, and uh, well, we're already here. <laughs> Look at this room. Look at this room. Okay, we're here. And I'm gonna call it. Oh wow, really? Yep. 
Next time on Pick Mario the Thousand Year Door, we're gonna go through this door because we got a lot going on after this. Believe you me. Stay tuned.